Good evening. Good evening, everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Hi, how are you? Can you can you hear me? Yes. yes. Okay, good, good. How are you, everybody? How's everybody? I'm fine. I'm fine, thank you. Yeah. How how are you? I'm pretty good, thank you. It's good to see everybody. Okay. Hello, Ingrid. Maricela. Welcome. Hi, teacher. Thank you. Hello, hello. Welcome. Okay. Um, all right. Well, we are going to start our class. Um, just give me one moment. Okay. So, Efrain Emilio Sevedo. No? Okay. Um, Stephanie Sarai Martinez. Stephanie Sarai Martinez. Okay. Um, he, he, Geraldine. Present. Okay, wonderful. Thank you. Um, Ingrid Maricela Flores. Here, teacher. Wonderful. Um, Irma Adriana Segura. Irma Adriana Segura. Okay. Uh, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Uh, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Okay, um, Juan David Ma Madrid. Present teacher. Sorry? Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Mm. <coughs> okay, just a second. Um, Just one moment, guys. Se me ha trabado esto. Um, ca Carla Melissa Colocho Santos. I'm here. Okay, wonderful. Um, Kevin uh, Josias Flores. Kevin uh, Josias Flores. Mm -hmm. eh, Lucia mm -hmm. eh, Elena Cepeda. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you. Uh, Mary Daniela Carranza. Eh, Mary Daniela Carranza. Milagro de la Paz Jiménez. Here I am, Miss. Wonderful, thank you. Um, Mina Janet Landos. Mina Janet Landos. Um, Nelson Adán Cacerón. Nelson Adán Cerón. Patricia Esmeralda García. Yes, thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Patricia Mar uh, Margarita Casillanos. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Roberto Isaías Monina. Roberto Isaías Monina. Eh, Ronald Alexis Martínez. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Uh, Roxana Elizabeth Díaz Rivera. Roxana Elizabeth Díaz Rivera. Y Sandra Elizabeth Asensio González. 
Pressing me. Okay, very good. Okay. All right, guys, I need everybody's cameras on, please. Because um, I don't see Carla Melissa Colocho. Y hay alguien que no sé quién es que su dispositivo le aparece como que está eh, conectando audio. No sé si es alguien que está conectando otro dispositivo, pero ya tiene ratitos de estar así. No sé qué pasa. No, no hay nadie de acá. Ok. Eh, Mila Janet Landos. Mira. Okay, creo que se conectó. Eh, Nelson Adán. Um, can I, hello, Nelson. Are you there? Okay. Um, what happened, Nelson? I, I can't hear you. I can't see you. Nelson Adán. Oh, okay, quizás. Uh, Nelson, are you the one that's trying to come in through another um, cell phone? Nelson Adán, are you trying to come in through another cell phone? Um, okay. All right. Um, Nelson, and then I still need you to, um, I need you to always though, like, at, I need you to have your, your camera on and everything. I do understand that there are inconvenience and everything. Um, but um, at least for the attendance and all, otherwise it won't register that you were there, okay? Because there is absolutely no way to know that you are, um, that, that you're present. Like we have, there is um, no registration in the platform that you are actually in the class. Like you just, it just says only registered registration that you connected but these conversations in the chat do not get registered. So when Insafor um, checks the, the, the videos, it's like you're not there. So um, yeah, it's, it's very important that you either turn on the, the camera so that we can see you or we can hear your voice, something, okay? Okay, so anyway, guys, uh, we're gonna move on um and i want to um ask you if uh, you can see my powerpoint so sorry not my not my powerpoint my screen so please tell me if you are able to see my screen can you see my screen or no Oh, yes. yes yeah. Okay, yes. perfect, perfect. Okay, let me just... Um... Okay, so we have um, housework, household chores. Um, we're going to says, find a, a phrase in the list that is usually paired with each verb. Okay, um, so... Here we're going to be, remember that yesterday we were looking at uh, verbs that are composed of two parts, like turn down or um, pick up. Do you remember that? Do you remember that? Yesterday we saw that? Yes. I yes? Yes, I remember. Okay. All right. Um, 
So what we're going to do is we're going to try to figure out which verbs that are actually called phrasal verbs go with what parts of the house, let's say. What is like those um, household chores that are very, um, very commonly used, okay? Um, okay, yes, we always have it, uh, the, the attendance at the beginning of the course, uh, of, of, the, of the class, everybody. Okay, so let's uh, let's try to figure out. We have here, um, clean off, um, clean up, <clears throat> hang up, pick up, put away, put out, take out, throw out, turn off, turn on. Okay, so everybody repeat after me. Clean off. Clean, clean off. off. Mm -hmm. Clean off. Clean, clean up. Off. Clean up. Clean, clean up. up. Hang up. Hang, Hang up. up. Hang up. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Put away. Put, Put away. away. Put out. Put out. Put, out. Put out. Put out. Take out. Take Pick out. out. Take out. out. Throw out. Throw out. Throw out. Throw out. out. Turn off. Turn, Turn off. on. Turn off. Turn off. Turn, Turn on. Turn on. Okay, good. Do you have Do you have any questions? Regarding these uh, phrasal verbs? Yes, teacher, I have a question. Mm -hmm. What's the difference between clean off and clean up? I think clean up is for um, big spaces like a garb, like a, for example, a yard or a house. Um, not exactly. Okay. Um, so clean off is usually, um, like you're going to, you have something, you, you have an object that, um, you, That, no, is no, dirty, the, that is dirty. That is dirty. Hold on, hold on. Just, just give, give me a moment. Give me a moment. Okay. So you have an object that is dirty, an object, and when you clean it off, it means that you clean that object. Okay. Yeah, that's that's clean off, but clean up is more general. It means like um, like a big room that you have to tidy to put things in the correct place to organize and uh, make sure that everything in that area is clean. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. So clean off um, probably could be with the oven. Clean off the oven, for example. Yes. He, okay. And the next clean up probably could be clean up the mess. Yes, right. For okay. example, clean up the kitchen. Okay. Right? Okay. okay. So maybe, yes, the oven is, you, you clean off the oven because it's an object and you clean up the kitchen because it's an area. Does that make sense? All right. Very clear. Yeah. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Good. Good. Excellent. Um, any other questions? <clears throat> what mean throw out? Throw out. Throw out. Throw out means to put in the garbage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. 
And yes. another question, teacher. I am a little confused with uh, two phrases here. Mm -hmm. uh, there are put away and put out. Put away and put out. Um, okay, so put out it literally means to take outside. Okay, to take outside. Um, uh, so put out, um, put out the garbage. Yeah. Um, so it means to, um, to take it from the inside to the out. Okay. And what was the other one? Put away. Put away. Okay. Um, put away means to um, put it in a in an area that is um, where it belongs, where something belongs. So, for example, um, let's say that you, okay, let's say that you're you're cooking, okay, in the kitchen, okay and you take out the ingredients because you're cooking then you have to put away the ingredients when you're finished it means that you have to take the ingredients back to the original place so if the the ingredients go back to the kitchen sorry to the fridge or to the cupboard um you know or wherever it is that you need to put them where they were originally where they originally came from okay does that make sense yes yeah. it makes sense thank you okay you're welcome anything else any other words i think it's clear Okay. Okay. All right. Very good. <clears throat> All right. So um, now let's look at the vocabulary related to the objects in the house. So we have the counter. Mm -hmm. Do you understand what is the counter? Lena? No idea Lena? what is. Hmm? Enough the counter. No, no, no. Just I we're looking at the vocabulary. Just looking at the vocabulary. Do you understand what is the counter? Ah, what is the counter? Mm -hmm. Como el mostrador o como al, yes. una tabla larga, algo así donde se pone algo, no? The counter. Yeah. Is the place where you Sorry. go when you are mm -hmm. uh, arriving at es como the, airport, the airport or something like that. It's like. Or, or the bank, when you were coming to the bank, you, you have a counter where the person is uh, um, attending, or I don't know, maybe. Okay. Sure. Okay. The, the, the counter is, 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 in Spanish, is una pizza. O sea, es como, como, um, lugar donde se colocan así los especieros o cosas por el estilo. Yeah, okay, so yeah, the counter, let's say, is like a, a let's say that like a, it could be like a piece of wood that is mm -hmm. put on top a, where you can put different objects. So for example, a, the counter, uh, you, there's like a counter in your kitchen. I'm sure you have a counter in your kitchen where you cook, right? So you can, um, so instead of actually um, cooking on a table, you cook on a board, let's say a, a big wooden board, where you can put all the ingredients and cook there. Yeah. Um, you can have a counter in the in the bathroom uh, where you put all of the all of your um, things from the bathroom, like uh, the toothbrush, the toothpaste. Um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Does that make sense? Yes. Yes? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. 
Um, so any 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 piece of um, board, any key piece of board, would it, it could be a wooden board or a plastic board, but any board where you can that that is flat where you can put things on there, that's uh that would be a counter. Does that make sense? Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Then we have uh the cat. You guys know the cat, right? <laughs> okay, the dry cleaning. The dry cleaning. Yes, we understand dry cleaning. It's like a laundry, but I don't know. It could be different. So the dry cleaning is the the clothes that you take to the dry cleaners. So um, clothes that you cannot wash at home, you take it to the dry clean, the cleaners. And that that is the dry cleaning. So they usually give you back the, the dry cleaning in, um, it could be like in a plastic bag. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yes. 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 yes thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. And let's continue with the next one. The faucet. Do you understand what is the faucet? No, teacher. Okay. So the faucet is the place where the water comes out in, in the bathroom or in the kitchen. You have a sink. And the faucet is um, the, the, the tube where the water comes out in the sink, okay? How do you say the faucet in Spanish? Grifo. Grifo, llave. Exactly, very good, very good. Okay, the groceries, do you understand what is the groceries? Comestibles. Hmm? Comestibles. Yeah, so groceries are all like basically the food that you buy at the supermarket, right? That's the groceries, okay? Anything, anything that you buy um, that is to eat um, at the groceries, sorry, at, at, at the supermarket, that would be the groceries. So it could In be Spanish like... Is, is los comprados. Los comprados, yeah, yeah, exactly. Specifically uh, speaking about food, something that you can eat, okay? All right, then we have the mess. The mess is pretty much um, anything that is not uh, in the right order, that is not clean, that is not organized. That's the mess, okay? Um, the oven, do we understand the oven? Yes, teacher. Yeah. Yes. So, so we have the oven is um pretty much the the part of the stove, the bottom part of the stove. Okay. So we have um so we have the 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 countertop of the stove, and inside uh we put the we have the oven. And the oven we use like to make, uh, for example, a cake, to bake a cake, to bake cookies. That's, you bake it in the oven. Okay? Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah? It's used to bake, to bake food. Mm -hmm. Okay, exactly, to, to bake food. Exactly. Then we have the garbage. You guys know understand the garbage, right? Trash? Yeah. The trash, the trash, the trash yeah. right? Yeah, the anything that that is not useful anymore, that you're that you you don't want in your house anymore, that's the garbage, okay? In nuestros compatriotas se oye como el garbage truck. Ah? En nuestros compatriotas generalmente se oye como el garbage truck. Oh, I've never heard of that. Okay, sure. Um. Okay. Good. And then we have um, the newspapers. So newspapers are uh, what you read in the morning. That's the newspapers. 
Um, yeah. So uh, yeah, it's 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 what you what you read usually in the morning to find out about the news. And then finally, we have the towels. Okay, the towels. Um, like towels are um, what you use when you take a shower and you want to uh, dry yourself uh, from the water, you know, like you dry your hair with uh, the towel. Do we understand this vocabulary? In the towels, uh, only is cook in the cooking or uh, your hands? No, no, no. Um, we have dish, we have all different types of towels. So we have a dish towel, which is um, for like, for example, to um, to dry the dishes when you wash them. After you wash the dishes and, and the dishes are wet, you can dry the dishes with a dish towel. But you can also have towels, like hand towels, like in, when you go to the bathroom and you wash your hands, you can have a hand towel to dry your hands. And then we have um, a, um, what do you call it? a body towel? A body towel is uh, to dry your body when you finish from from the um, from the shower. Okay, does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. Yes, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Anything else? No, nothing else. Okay. All right, very good. So what I want you to do now is you're going to match. What do we say? Which verb, which phrasal verb, which two, two word verb goes which, with which one of these um, objects from the house? Okay, so I want you right now, um, we're going to be working in pairs, okay? And um, yeah, maybe about pairs or 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 small groups. It, it will depend. Um, you might be in a pair. Or you may be in a small group. Um, so you're going to be matching. Okay, does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Um, so let me send this to you in the WhatsApp group. Okay, I just sent it right now. I want to know if you got it. Did you get it? You received it or no? Yes or no? Yes, is there. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you for confirming. So we're going to be sending so sending you guys to breakout rooms so that you can work on this. And like I said, um, you might be in groups of in pairs or in or it may be, um, uh, what's it called, um, or a group of three, okay? Um, just wanna make sure, Carla, Melissa, are you, are you there? Carla, Melissa? No. Okay. Buenas. Roberto, I guess, will not be participating. I'm going to be moving some people. Okay. Um, just one moment.
Okay. Right now, I'm going to send you guys uh, to the breaker rooms. Here we go. By the counter. Uh -huh. uh, entonces. We we'll have to choose the the the, the phrase. Yeah. Yes. What is the correct? And clean up. What can be? Mm, clean up. For me. Uh -huh. The counter. Yeah, yeah, it can be yeah. right. Clean up. Clean up the, the oven, the oven, or not? Oh, the... oh, 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 clean up. Oh, maybe clean off the oven. Right. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Hang up. It, it's like a levantar. Yes. No. Okay, uh, uh, hang up the newspaper can be. Ah, oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You pick up, it's like a um, pick up, pick up, it's like a recoger también. Mm -hmm. I... Ah. Uh... Pick up the garbage. Emilio. The oven? It could be the oven. The oven. The oven. The oven. And clean up. That will be... Mm. The counter. Poster. I think it could be the counter. Because it's like an area. Kind of an area. Because that's the closest one because we don't have any like places here. Pick up the garage, the garbage. Pick up the garbage. Uh, yeah. Garbage. Put away the mess. Put away the mess. Mm -hmm. Put out. Um, put out the faucet. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm going to stop sharing. Okay, ahorita. Mm -hmm. Esta. So for that. Okay. Okay, the garbage is turned out. Turn out the garbage. Um thing off the mess. The mess. The mess. Right. Uh, it, it may be a new paper now. Um, clean off the new paper. No. You, no. <laughs> the, 
Debbie, you, what are you doing, Debbie? Yeah, wait, wait, you're uh, um... No, the teacher told us that it's like uh, organized, that everything has to be in the area. Oh. The, mm. on the area that pertenece. Okay. Sir, which oh, which oh, one was no, that? Maybe. Which which verb was that? Put away. Huh? Yeah. No, clean up. Put away. Clean up. Clean up. Uh, do you need papers? And um, is is it the example? Clean up. Off. Clean up Clean off. the mess. Off. Off. Yeah. Pick up. I guess is a newspaper. Ah. Pick up maybe. Okay. Okay, maybe. Maybe. Pick up. Um, oh. Hang up, maybe the dry cleaning. Hang up. That's difficult, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> turn off, turn off, it's a cat. What the four is 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 saying the exercise 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 excuse me exercise okay is drop to get to cut um is no lo no no puede escribirlo usted David no sí, puede sí. escribir las palabras para ver cuál vamos haciendo mejor porque si no más no siento que avancemos Okay. Do you know how to um, do you know how to write in the in the in do you know yes, how to... he, kn he knows to oh, do okay. it. Okay. Um, All right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Perfect. In the example, uh, clean up uh, your side I um the other one? Yes. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay. <laughs> See you later. Okay. Uh, yes. Are you finished? Uh, we think so. <laughs> yeah? yeah? Okay, great. I will see you in the main room then. Okay? Okay. Okay. Okay, guys and girls, um, so we're going to be checking right now the answers. Um, please tell me if you can see my screen. Okay, um, okay here we go. Can you see my screen? Yeah. Okay, perfect. All right, so we have clean off. What do we clean off? What do we clean off? The counter. Yes, very good. The countertop. The countertop and the, the oven too. The counter, uh-huh. We can clean off the oven. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Can you clean Very... off? Can you clean off the faucet? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you could. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not as common, but it's possible. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Clean up. 
Limas. Limas. Para. Uh, actually, um, okay, um, actually, I think, I think I would actually, hold on a second, I think we could do it like this, clean up the counter, and oh, okay. instead of that, I would put here the faucet. Okay. Yeah, I think that it's going to make a little more sense because the counter could be a big area. Oh. Remember, the counter could be a big area that you have to um, put away things, you have to um, clean it, et cetera, et cetera, right? You can organize it so it could be cleaned up. Yeah. Okay. okay. All right. Hang up. What are we going to hang up? Dry clean. Yes, definitely the dry clean because oh, okay. um, oh, yes. because remember I told you that it's like sometimes they're going to put the dry cleaning, um, you know, in, in a plastic bag, you know, and uh, they're going to yeah. return it to you. What else? Hang up. The towels? The towels, the towels yeah. The towels. Very good. Okay. Pick up. Pick up the cat. The groceries. The newspaper, teacher, miss. Um. Oh yes. The newspaper. Pick up the newspaper. Yeah. yeah. You can pick up. You can pick up the dry cleaning too, right? Yes. Very good. So then, yeah, pick up the newspaper because they could, they could like um have thrown it pick on the floor, up. right? Like um, they usually leave it on the, like if you have a house, they will leave it like on the doorstep so you can pick up the, the newspaper. And yes, you can pick up the dry cleaning. Um, okay. uh, why the dry cleaning? Do you, why do you pick up the dry cleaning? Because also pick up can have the, the idea that you, um, that you Go stop, place? yeah, you stop by a place to get something. Okay, mm -hmm. so yes, it could be the pick up the dry cleaning, put away. And, and what about the cat? Can you pick up the cat when you um, go to a place to leave it, leave them, leave it, leave him or leave it? Can you pick up? Yeah, it's possible. Like I said, not very common, but it is possible. If yeah. You, uh, take the cat to the veterinarian, and you 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 uh you come again to pick him up. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, yeah, you could. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay. okay so put away. All right. Put away. What are you gonna put away? The garbage. Put away the garbage. Yeah. Put away no, the groceries. Away. Yes, the, the groceries definitely. So, um, you groceries are going to be in a plastic bag, and so you're going to probably put them either in the the fridge, in the um, a, what's it called? Uh, the cabinet. In the basket. In the middle basket. Yeah. yeah. Et cetera. Et cetera. Et cetera. Yeah. Put away. Anything else? What do you put away? Oh, no. Put away. Yeah. The mess. The mess. What? Put away the mess? No, because put away means to put something in the place where it originated. So you put create away. a towels. mess. Towels? Yeah, the towels? the towels. Put away the towels. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's what I was thinking. Mm-hmm. Good. Okay. Put out. Out the counter. Mm, no, remember, put out means to uh take outside of the house. 
The cat, the cat, the cat the can be? The cat, yeah, definitely the cat. Put out the cat. So uh, maybe the cat should be outside. What mm -hmm. else? The garbage, exactly, because the garbage does not belong in the house. So you put out the garbage. Yeah. Okay. Take okay. out. Uh, the groceries, the towels. Take out the towels. Okay. And the, the groceries when you are cooking? The gro take out the groceries. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Also, you could say take out the garbage. And what it means, take out the garbage, does not mean to put it outside of the house. It means to put it outside of the house in an area where the garbage truck can pick it up. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so you can take out the, you can put out the garbage, which means to put it outside of your house, but ready, not necessarily, ready. not necessarily is it going to be taken out the garbage because taking out the garbage means to put it in the area where the garbage can, can or sorry, the, the garbage truck can go and pick it up. Does in that the make sense? Yeah, in the container, usually. Exactly. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. Um, all right. Let's continue. Throw out. The garbage. Yeah. The garbage. Yeah. The garbage. Oops. Dina. The garbage. Okay, throw out the garbage. Anything else? Yep. The what? Newspapers. The, the newspaper, kids. yeah, the newspapers, throw out the newspapers. Good. Turn off. Um, then, hmm? turn the faucet. The faucet, yes, yes, turn off the faucet. Turn the oven, the, the, the oven, oven. Yes. the oven, yes, the oven. That's very good. And turn on, it's, it's the same, turn on, turn on, could be the same, right? Yeah. Yeah. Turn on, yeah, turn on the oven. The faucet and turn on the faucet. Yeah, good. Any questions so far? No, it's a kind of difficult for me. <laughs> I will try to practice. Okay, okay, good, In good. Part. Yes. Mm -hmm. I, I'm going to take a picture, teacher. Okay. You can take a picture. It's not easy for me put out and take out. Thank you. Um, so put out means to put outside of your house. Take out, it, it means to um, put, for example, you take, you take out means to you have something in a specific place and you um, like inside of something and you take it out of that place. Um, so for example, sorry, it's, yeah. So you can um, take out the, the, the towels. Um, it means that they were, um, they were in the closet, for example. The towels were in the closet and now you take from the closet outside so that you can use them. The same and thing with the groceries. And the refrigerator is the same closet and you uh, have you apple or refrigerator. Yeah. Yeah, for example, maybe you can have um okay, you're gonna you're going to cook. 
um, and you have the chicken in the freezer. You can take out the chicken from the freezer. So it means that the the the, the chicken was um, kept. It was it, it, they they you kept it in the freezer. That's the the original place where you had it, and you leave it out of the of where it was where it was kept. So yes, mm -hmm. that would be it. okay. Whereas like put out, it means to literally, um, yeah, to take out of your house. Uh, what is the difference uh, between put out and throw out? So throw out literally means to um, to something that you don't need anymore and you don't want it in your house. You want them to take it away. Okay. Okay. That's okay. throw a throw out. So that means it, it's not useful for you anymore. So you want it outside of your house. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Okay. When All right. you are, when you have your car in your garage, you can use put out the car. Can you use the, the put out the car or not? No, this would be take out. Take, take out that. the car. Take out the car. Because remember, take out means that it it has a, an original place mm -hmm. and you want the thing outside of its original place. But put out means that you um you don't you don't want it in your house, but you just put it outside of your house because you don't want it. You don't want it yeah. to be inside of the house. But but for a period of time or or what? Uh, just usually put out means um that it's gonna be outside of the house. Okay. Okay. Um because you don't want it in the house. Like yeah. the garbage, you know, like in the case of the garbage, you don't want the garbage for just a period of time out of the house. You don't want the ha the garbage in the house, period. But, but the cat. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I'm that's why I'm saying that it's, yeah, that's why I'm saying that it's it doesn't have to do with the period of time. It has to do uh -huh. with the fact that you don't want that thing in the house. Yeah. Okay, what it doesn't matter if if, you, if it's if for a, for a small period of time or a long period of time that doesn't matter. It's just that you don't want the thing in the house. Yeah. Okay. Then things are animals too. Yeah. Things are animals. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Like yeah, for example, imagine you found a spider in your mm -hmm. your house you probably mm -hmm. want to put it out okay 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 all right okay all right very good very good everybody so it's it's all clear for everybody okay i am going to now share it this give me a moment Okay, so my question is, what requests can you make in each of the places? So the kitchen, what requests could you make in the kitchen? Request. Mm -hmm. What requests can you make in the kitchen? Put away the ingredients. Okay, put away the ingredients. What else? Turn off or turn on the oven. Good. Uh, clean up the kitchen. Yes. Okay, good. What about the living room? What requests would you make in the living room? Uh, clean up the living room. Okay. Good. Um, clean up the living room. Um, 
put away your shoes, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Or or pick up hang, your things. Pick up hang your up things. Your, hang up your your coat. Hang or... up your coat. Yes, very good. Mm -hmm. What about the bathroom? Um, what request can you make in your bathroom? Put away towels in the bathroom. Put away the towels. Oh, hang up the, the towels. Clean off the faucet. Clean off okay. the bathroom. Clean, yeah, so Put clean up. off the faucet. Okay, good. What about the bedroom? Um, Put away the garbage. <laughs> or, okay. Yeah. Yeah, could be. Mm -hmm. um, clean up. Hang up your clothes. Okay, hang up your clothes. Okay, very good. Okay. Clean up, clean up. Uh, oh, no, the bedroom. Yes, clean mm -hmm. up the bedroom. Good. Okay. Throw out the, the garbage. Yes, throw out the garbage. Very good. Okay, bravo. Excellent, guys. Okay, we're going to stop there uh, right now, and I'm just going to quickly uh, take the attendance. Um, so please tell me um, if you're here. Efrain Emilio Acevedo. Chat teacher. Sorry? In chat. The chat, he's, he's right in the chat. Okay. All right. Guys, remember we need to also, we need to um, say present. Um, mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Stephanie Saray Martinez. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Um, Geraldine Lisette Villeda. Present teacher. Excellent. Ingrid Maricela Flores. Present teacher. <clears throat> All right, excellent, thank you. And um, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Present oh. teacher. Okay, good. Um, Irma Adriana Segura. Irma Adriana Segura. Okay. Um, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Oh, no, Present yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. uh, Jose, oh, sorry, Juan David uh, Madrid. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Carla Melissa Colocho. Present. Uh, Kevin Josias Flores. Kevin Josias Flores. Eh, Lucía Elena Cepeda. Present teacher. Eh, Mirin Daniela Carranza. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Milagro de la Paz Jiménez. I'm here, I'm here. Mirna Janet Landos. Mirna Janet Landos. Eh, Nelson Adanceron. Nelson Adanceron. Um, Patricia Esmeralda García. Present. Eh, Patricia Margarita Castellanos. Present. Roberto Isaías Molina. Roberto Isaías Molina. Eh, Ronald Alexis Martínez. Good night, teacher. Eh, Roxana Elizabeth Díaz. And Sandra Elizabeth uh, Asensio. I am here, teacher. Okay, very good, guys. All right, that will be all for today, guys. I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? See you. See you. See you.